Welcome back, guys. We are joined as always by Ace Hedgehog. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. And what are you up to? Not being a robot. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and you're not a robot either. Um, I am still messed about with these uh, things. I've done a few things off camera because we got carried away. Um, I, I am, uh, I have gone and defended the coal mine, which is struggling. Mm-hmm. Oh dear. Um, but we might be able to wean ourselves off coal soon. Uh, that would be nice. Um, uh, and uh, I am building some things here. I build a second pulverizer for this. I'll work on this coal miner to try and get the coal miner running. Okay. But there's things in here that I can't exactly process. Um, like this red, red block called Vulcanite. Mm hmm. Um, not quite sure what to do with that. Uh, also, I need filter inserters. Okay. We can make them. That is good. Did I not see a random box with some wooden things in it just a moment ago? Uh, most likely. There it is. There some... is a random box with wood and sulfur in it. Oh, two wood. It's got two wood and three sulfur in it. So that's that's not actually as helpful as what's hopefully it's going to be. Uh, well, what's under attack now? Oh, there's there. Wait, well, that's right. Uh, I've also cleaned out some biting nests up there, but um, uh, I, I did actually record that, um, um, and I would tag that onto the end of the last episode, which okay. is a very weird thing to say because you would have seen the end of the last episode. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, I suppose so. Weird recording things. Uh, yeah. Um, so now our defenses are very dark because I still don't put lights in anywhere. Um, and uh, we have uh, there. Uh, it's funny because uh, Pete actually mentioned that um, his game isn't as dark as this one when okay. he, when he uh, goes to the map view and I'm like we haven't done anything else and I've looked at the settings and nothing has changed uh, no uh, but I mean YouTube makes everything darker right so it does but I mean even to me it's very dark I don't know it's very yeah weird. it is very dark to me as well that's true I don't know I don't know, maybe it's just a, a figment of our imaginations. I don't know. Maybe. Right, I need, I need, uh, what do I need? I need, uh, many things. Uh, I, what I'm doing is I am uh, making, uh, what are they called? Processing units. Uh, because we want to get power armor. Yes, indeed. Uh, so I am making processing units. And we have a whole 14 so far. It's going very fast. Excellent. It'll be done by... Well, maybe by the time we start recording next week. Hmm. I have fed a bunch of stuff. Whoa. Big electric pole recycling, medium electric pole recycling, recycling radar recycling. Yeah, yeah, we can recycle things back into uh, scrap, and then from scrap we can recycle it back into iron copper. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what? <laughs> well, that's pretty cool. It is. It is because uh, that does mean um, like stuff that we don't need anymore. We can like just... small wooden electric poles. We can get back to uh, base copper and wood. Yeah. Um, when we upgrade things, which is which is cool. I like the idea. I don't think many of the other ones will be of any use. No, Cargo maybe not. pods, broken data cards. I don't even know what they are. Me neither. All right. So, unless we get wireless energy transmission at some point, I don't really think the other ones are going to be of much use. Uh, but I think we do. Get okay. wireless well, then they energy transmission. Be but maybe it's just between planets or something? Possibly. Uh, I don't know. I will. We'll figure it out when we get here. Yeah. That's what we'll um, do. Uh, so. This is going to be the fun part. 
Iron, iron and copper. Iron. Oh, excuse me, I've got the hiccups. Iron and copper is easy. Easy to process. Okay. <laughs> it's just that with such confidence. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah. Uh, but basically, it is. it's easy to process. Uh, basically, one every second, seven seconds. That we do. Input left, output right. But actually, I don't. I don't even need to do that. I don't think this is going to have a, a huge impact oh, on the world. Seven seconds. Okay. Machines making those. Which basically uh, means that we just need one machine making stone furnaces. Uh, could we possibly get this down here? I suppose we could. So, stone furnace production there. steel furnace productions and, and this one does need a merger five electronic furnace, furnace okay. productions okay so we do need steel to come down this way because you need steel you need steel Steel going all the way. Uh, the stone, I guess, just needs to come to here. Uh, input on the left, output on the right. There. There. And there. You are to do copper. You are to do copper. Right. Right. Uh, now I need to deal with. S oh my days. Basically, you need to get some stone brick down here. We need to make heat shielding. We're not making heat shielding, are we? Anywhere? I don't think so. Jesus. This this is not going to work. This is not going to work. Scrap it. Scrap it. Scrap it. Use the deconstruction thing. Yay, robots! Yay! <laughs> They're really slow, so I'm going to help them out. But robots can do things. Woo! Yay! Only the robots. Uh, this thing. Man, this got more complicated than I thought it'd be. <laughs> So, it's two heat shielding. How long does it take to make heat shielding? Ten seconds. Brain hurts. Uh, okay. Why is that? Uh, are you having to do the difficult thing of adding up? I am. It is very difficult. It is very, very difficult. Oh, Jesus. Uh, okay, so we need. Two heat shielding every five seconds times five, that's ten heat oh, shielding. Oh, what now? What the? What the? Well, that's twenty heat shielding. Mind you, I suppose. Um, well, that they attacked there before. to defend this area. Yeah. 
It's a good thing you're right nearby. Alright, so... Two heat chilling every five seconds. Five machines. Where are they coming from, though? They're coming from down here. So that means we need ten heat chilling a second. Um... Ten heat it's weird that second. they seem to skip over the iron and go for the uh, steel. Yeah, that is weird. So I need ten machines making heat shielding. Okay. Um, I think I'm going to make that down here. I think I think we do. I think I need to keep up on this coal mine thing. I want I want to get the coal mine thing working, but um, it's it's taking a long time. Yeah. Uh, so I might give up on the coal miner and. Uh... Needs three inputs. I'm just come and get a new mine running. That might make more sense. Uh, so, where... Oh, I'm out of belts. It's not good. We're going to tackle that one on the left-hand side, or... Well, actually, the one up north is quite difficult to... Uh, uh iron? Or a whole expedition. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I, I'm thinking the one down here. Okay, I don't know where I'm going. I am going here. Get belts. Hey, jetpack. Woo! <laughs> Stack of you, um, setters. Couple of stacks of you. Mm -hmm. And then come up to you. And Um, you. Stick that in to make more uh, processing units. Oh, back behind a wall. Now, Pete, you did mention that. Why don't I just use the uh, the jetpack? And uh, the main reason is that I forget that I have it. <laughs> All right. Let's see chilling. Wait out. Oh, sorry. Uh, train enter from the right. Uh, Copy blueprint. I'm using the wonderful Autotorio again to. Uh, oh, right, right, right. Create me a blueprint. 
Okay, so we want stone tablets on the inside and steel and sulfur on the outside. So we kind of need the sulfur to continue on here. Steel plate. Wow, there's not a lot. We are really, really short on steel plate. Yes, yes, we are really, really short on lots of things. Yeah, true. some trees before I enable my robots because there's no point in picking up robots. Although trees are now useful for making green circuits, so I suppose it's not as bad doing it this way. Yeah, but you still have to set up the production for those circuits using um, using the trees. Yes, yeah, but you know, it's uh, it's not, it's not as terrible. That's going to take forever for those robots to build, uh, which is fine, which is absolutely fine. Um, I did do an extra route. Uh, oh, is there something we can research? I don't know, possibly. Let's see, I'll check. Go and uh, have a look, see. Oh, chemical right. science pack, yes. We can research that. Uh, life support facility. Acid provider and storage warehouse. A umbrella. Uh, umbrella energy beam defense facility. All right. Rocket fuel from water. Ooh, satellite rocket silo. Ooh, ooh. That means we can press the uh, the the uh, the the whatever button is. I kept pressing by mistake, <laughs> and I can't remember what button it was now. So, adaptive armor two. Armor that uses energy to self-repair fills, fills a similar role to energy shields with lower power requirements but much slower regeneration. Okay. Effect transmission. Big mining drill. Yeah, I saw that. I was like, hmm, that sounds uh, interesting. <laughs> yeah, it does. It does. Right, what else did we need here? We needed uh, stone tablets. Were we making electric poles anywhere? Nope. Nope. Okay. Woot, construct 100 machines using robots. Woot. Already? <clears throat> Apparently so. Man. And I haven't even built one. My robots are awesome. All four of them. Yeah, I bet they are. Go off. Doing their thing. Living their best lives. That's right. Oh, I just got the achievement too. Yay, I did it too. Even without even having a robot. Excellent. Good job. Pretty impressive, Your huh? come far. Yep. Your talents... Tents come to I'm 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 stunned. Absolutely stunned. Certainly don't need last ones here. Um 
What's that? Life support facility? <gasps> no, if you keep researching all the things, we have all this new stuff that I don't know what it does. <laughs> I'm well, guessing a life support facility is something that could give you life in space? Uh, I mean, possibly. That would be a good a good assumption. Uh, maybe some something that produces oxygen or, or something. I don't know. I mean yeah, that's that's that is that is highly possible. Rushed cryonite. Oh. Slush ice? Cryonite slush? Don't worry about Any on ion first. exchange beads. That's weird. I turned my robots off. Yeah, a robot is now going to repair something. Maybe it had already decided to before you did it. Possibly. Must have a mind of their own. Yeah. All right, so that's the heat shielding done. Then we really do need... Uh, stone furnace. The three... Yeah. Regular furnaces. Well, I, need, I need I need a Regular million furnaces. power poles. Yeah. You. Did all the iron there? Bump. I made put this too close. Uh. No, because what I can do is I don't need these down there, so this can be here. Uh yeah. Yeah. All right, so the stone can come in here. That's fine. Actually, no, stop that, stop that, stop that, stop that, stop, stop making those, stop making those. Because there is a chest in here, uh, I found, I don't know where it is now, damn it. Um, which you were putting engine units and iron poles into, and I was very confused by it. Uh, putting both in there? Yeah, I think you just had a grabber grabbing um, from a line. I can't remember where it was. Oh, it could be. There's a wooden chest. That's. Uh, I do not remember where it was. Uh, ah, N. N is the random button that asks for satellites. Uh huh. Uh, Why are you hitting N? Because I want to press M for map. Ah. They they do look very similar, the N and the M. Especially when you're not looking at them. Yep. Uh, I might have I want boxed to find myself this random chest so here. I can pick it up because I think I think it was a temporary chest for you to do something with, and it's just been left there. Because we now have other chests that are doing iron uh, um, motors and things. Okay. Loads of uh, random stuff in a box there. Uh, fuel. Red. 483 red circuits. That sounds uh, like a very useful box. It does. It does. Sounds like it's got lots of wonderful things inside that would probably be very useful to actually be on belts and not in boxes. <laughs> I think it was early on that I decided that, that it would be nice to have just to go pick up instead of 
having to handcraft it all the time? Yes, yes, possibly. There, there it is. There it is. It's directly below. It's where, it's where I was looking. I'm blind. Uh, so you've got a box here where I'm stood, which uh, is is grabbing motors. It's got 200 uh, electric motors in it, mm -hmm. which is fine. And then you've got this random wooden box here, which is grabbing from the belt and the iron pole belt. Oh, it's, it's... that belt belt was uh, that 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 box is probably a mistake. Well, I'm going to pick it up because I could use the iron poles to make electric, um... Yeah. Electric things. Things, yeah. Yeah, electric things. Install. And I can take the motors over to uh, the uh, other lubricant factory face thing. To uh, add more to that. Yeah. Um, and there's a random box with um, circuits here that isn't doing anything. It's not putting them on the line. It's not doing anything. Okay. With with electric circuits. With with green circuits. Yeah. Well, that's also because I, I feel like sometimes it's useful to just go be able to go grab some. But it's not got a. It, it, it's not being full. It's it's not it's not. It, there's no inserter into it. It's just a box <laughs> with stuff in it. It's like. Okay, well, that, that's that's a mistake, then. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. Uh, right, and walls. There were walls being made. Well, Apple walls and belts. Made. Belts I need. Belts are up here. Ah, do you know what? I'm going to use that random box that has green circuits in. Okay. And I'm going to put it into the box that is for the splitters. Because they manually uh, still require manual feeding of green circuits. Oh, yeah, right, right, right. But that's fine. That's fine because I can I can do that right now. Uh, boom. Boom. in there. Boom, boom. Okay. We need this to come down here somewhere, somehow, some way. I to do that. Well. Suppose what we could do is... Oh no, something uh, like that. <coughs> Vulcanite. I don't want any Vulcanite on me. Put that in my trash for the moment. Something like that. And then. None. Thank you. Uh, okay. Something like that. Now, Just where did I park my tank? Up there. Just need to have the belt. Um we also need oh we don't need oh, anything stop else, stop actually. stop you have actually built things in here so right uh, robots, go do your thing need... the fact that I can run faster than robots yeah with no legs well, no bonus legs, I should say. I've got legs. You do? Okay, you. I do. I have legs. I don't, I don't have mechanical legs. We've got normal ones. So, uh, yeah, they uh, do a pretty good job, I think. Yeah. All right, so that's being made. Oh, 
I know why I want it like that. But we can get... Oh, sorry, robots. Steel furnaces onto the heat shielding vent. That'll work. So... Or will it? You'll never guess what. We're out of time. How'd you guess? Oh, man. <laughs> well, I'm, uh, I'm intuitive like that. I'm intuitive like that. But yeah. Yes, we are. Yep. We are out of time again. Again. So I guess we I shall... Think this keeps happening. It does. It just keeps happening. It's it's weird. It's weird. Uh, but I guess we will call it here then. That yeah, that would make sense. Yes. Yeah. All right. So um, thank you very much for watching, guys. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe? And we'll see you next time. Have fun. <laughs>